Here to talk more about Philadelphia style as we kick off Fashion Week is Alana Tosti, Editor-in-Chief of Modern Luxury Weddings Philadelphia. Alana, thank you for being with us this morning. Thank you so much for having me. Yes. I want to start with the Emmys because I yes. loved the fashion on the purple carpet last night. My personal favorite look was Zendaya. She made everyone loved green with envy. <laughs> she was gorgeous. Um, I have a lot of favorites, but one of mine was actually Mandy Moore. Oh, yeah. Um, I might be a little biased because she was um, Philly Style's Best of Style cover um, a couple months ago. Oh, okay. But <laughs> she rocked that red and pink look. We did see a lot of that trending yeah, last night, but I do think that Mandy did it best. Just the hair, the makeup, the whole look, I just really loved what she had going on. So. Yeah, and we saw a lot of that red and pink combo last night. That's something... We did, yeah. I, I mean, a lot of people had it. It was mm -hmm. just very popular. But so, color in general, too. I mean, so many bright colors was really popular. Yeah, yeah. And I also, and we see some more of that red and pink combo here. Look at Taraji. Oh, yes, girl, work it. I loved yes. it. My favorite, though, Laverne Cox. This dress is amazing. It's from Mansouri. Love this dress. It's so fun and flirty and feminine and just beautiful. She looked like a rock star. She did, she did. Another fan for me was Melanie Liebert from This Is Us. I mean, look at this suit. I mean, and we saw a lot of these power suits, but I liked her take on this. Yes, and I love the white and black combo too. Mm -hmm. I think that looks really sharp. Yeah, the, a lot of that color blocking. Is that something that you would say is on trend for Absolutely. the Absolutely. I'm seeing color blocking everywhere. So, I mean, I think it's a good representation of what's on the carpet in terms of what people are going to be wearing. Mm -hmm. And in speaking the fall. of the white and black, another pop in color, this yellow on Kristen Cavalieri. Oh, this is so fun. <laughs> I just love her. I mean, she is just so bright and cheerful and fun. And yellow is just such a fun pop of color. Mm -hmm. And I want to talk about some more of your other favorite looks. Brittany Snow, for example, she looked classic. I love this. Yes, she gives us such a Cinderella vibe. I just love this Jay Mendel gown on her. Um, she's very classic, very old Hollywood glamour, mm -hmm. just very chic. Yeah, and another stunner, Amelia Clark from Game of Thrones. Oh my gosh, she is <laughs> stunning. I mean, this Valentino gown is just absolutely stunning. The plunging neckline, the bow around the waist. Yeah. I just love everything about it. She's a queen. I mean, she's and literally a queen. And that neckline, who can pull that off? I know. I, I mean, can't. <laughs> <laughs> she can. She's literally a queen. I yes, mean. literally. <laughs> and then another favorite, Jamila Jamil from The Good Place. Yes, this is Monique Lillier, which is really big in the bridal world, but just beautiful. I love the color, how fresh it is. Mm. I love that she did her own makeup. I mean, did she? yes. I mean, I just can't believe how good you can look and do your own makeup, but she did. And the gown, the coral lip, it just goes so well for her. I love that. But now I got to talk about some of the looks that I didn't like too much. <laughs> this Amy Adams, I, girl, what is going on here? Tell I us. mean, <laughs> Yeah, uh, not the best pick. No, not the and best pick for her. Zoe's Kazan. I wasn't feeling her look either. I, oh. Yeah, this was red and pink gone a little wrong. I agree. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I agree. She tried with the trend, but not uh, not one of my favorites either. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I don't know what's up with the puffy sleeves, but here we have Dasha Polanco. I mean, these remind me of floaties almost. Yeah, I, there's something to be said about a beautiful sleeve. Mm -hmm. This is just not exactly. Uh, that. <laughs> nice. Yeah. But speaking of fashion, let's talk about Philly Fashion Week. As we mentioned yes. earlier, it kicks off today. There's a ton of events going on throughout the week. What are some things that people should know about it? So Philly Fashion Week kicks off today yes. through Saturday. Um, there's events, there's shopping, cocktail parties, runway shows every single day. There's over 30 designers this year, which I think wow. is Philly's biggest season that we've had so far. That's incredible. Which is super exciting. Um, if you can't make any of the shows during the week, um, make sure you go to Shop Center City Saturday. That is on Saturday the 28th. Um, it's Center City District. Retailers and restaurants are putting on the biggest deals, discounts, gifts with purchase. It's going to be so much fun. Nice. Well, I am excited. I'm actually going to the opening night tonight, so oh, I can't great. wait. Oh, great. Great. So, Alana, thank you so much for joining us thank this morning. Thank you so much for having me. Yes, absolutely. And for more information about Philly Fashion Week and what you thought about the Emmy fashions from last night, check out our Philly Live Facebook group.